Hey everyone, dropping in to wish you all a very merry festive season. We hope that your days are filled with love and laughter, that you're hanging with your tribe and you're doing the things that bring you joy. Yeah, I was just speaking to Darren last night because he's not here at the moment, unfortunately. And he, as well as I, wanted to uh, convey to you all a heartfelt thank you for watching our channel, for following along on our journeys and adventures in the past year. Uh, it uh, really means a lot to us and uh, I just wanted to say to you that as much as you tell us that we inspire you, you guys actually inspire us because you know it makes us get out to be more curious in the world and to um, to seek out different adventures and different experiences and to go to places and we have met the most wonderful people and we've had the most incredible experiences this year. I've just been going back through the footage of Vanuatu especially. It was just an amazing, amazing time for us. And um, yeah, it's uh, you guys who help inspire us to really continue exploring and um, having these experiences. So thank you very much for all that you do for us. Yeah, and um, you know, I was uh, reflecting this morning. I was missing Dazzle actually. And uh, when we got together, he gave me this very cool card and it says, anything that you can dream in your heart, you can create in your world. And um, <laughs> he lucked on it really, because it just, it just totally is, is me and my whole philosophy around life. And um, I was reflecting on it because um, this year could have been very, very, very different for Darren and I. I could have been doing chemotherapy and radiation and the whole picture would have looked like significantly different. And um, yeah, uh, the reason that I wanted to talk to you about that is because it's about choice, right? And it's something that I wanted to sort of give as a little gift for you guys, perhaps, for, um, for this time of year when we all seem to sort of sit back and reflect on our lives and take stock of how the year's been and make plans for the next year or so. And, you know, um, uh, I follow this rule where everything that I do has to bring joy and it has to lift me up and lift our spirits and grow us in some way. And so I wanted to be able to continue my treatment um, for my health and, you know, revolutionizing my health and getting my health back. Um, but I wanted to do that in a way that didn't bring us down, that actually allowed us to still live our life and live a meaningful life and still do the things that brought us joy and so I said to Darren you know I really want to be able to keep sailing and keep going and keep exploring uh, and you know I'm just so grateful that he was a hundred percent on the bandwagon with me and um, it's allowed us to have the most incredible year <laughs> and, um, and I just wanted to say to you that if any of you are sitting on the fence and you're on the sideline you've got this thing that you really 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 love doing or you'd love to do an experience you'd love to have or a new thing that you'd like to start or whatever it might be and you've got some things holding you back like I don't know whatever they might might be I just wanted to say that like life can be short or life can be long and you never know which card you're gonna draw right and but either way um, in that time that you're here on this planet, I want to encourage you to make it like the best time of your life, to live you the be live your best life, to, to, you know, what else are we here for but for joy and happiness and to feel, feel, to feel fulfilled and to feel like we're doing, having our best life. And so I just really wanted to, if, it, if there was anything I could gift you guys this year, I just wanted to say, you know, step out of your comfort zone and step off and jump and leap and go and do whatever it is that makes you really, really happy, that cranks you. To me, you can't put a value on fulfillment. There is no monetary value on feeling so utterly inspired and captivated and having the coolest experiences and doing the things that really, really, really lift you up. They're the things, but they are the things that, that I really encourage you, you know, just grab onto it, <laughs> just go, just leap, you know. This year has been extremely challenging in many ways for Darren and I, um, because I have been going through this health challenge at the same time as we have been traveling and sailing and exploring. It's been hard and we haven't always known exactly how it's all gonna pan out. We haven't always known <laughs> what our next move's gonna be, but I absolutely, encourage you while you're on this planet do that which brings you joy <laughs> and that's my Christmas gift to you um, I hope it resonates with someone with one of you <laughs> that would be cool <laughs> you know I I when Darren and I first got together I 
I wrote him this little journal and I read it from time to time when I'm missing him when he's when we're not together and I've been missing him this morning very much and um, yeah this is full of love quotes and lift you up inspirational quotes and travel quotes and all sorts of things and <laughs> the one <clears throat> excuse me the one that keeps coming up for me is do that which makes your heart sing so do that which makes you smile and uh, yeah that's what I would love to give to you guys the gift that maybe I can implant this little thought little seed in your brain that you will spend the next year doing that which makes your heart sing <laughs> okay that's it from me and vicariously from Darren wishing you a very merry festive season once again and uh, yeah we'll see you in the next video